Aw, dick. Free oil change, Jim. Thanks a lot for coming along with Life with Belsif. Let's see what's really going on. How you doing today? Welcome to Life with Belsif. I had my truck recall done for the airbag. As you know, I told you about that. And they cracked the dash up. So it's not a big deal. I, you know, the truck's old, plastic gets old, and this and that and the other thing. So I called him up and said, listen, I know it wasn't there because you had to take the airbag out to change your update and this and that and the other thing. And I clean my dash regularly. And I don't want anything out of you. I don't want a new dash or anything. The truck's old and this and that and the other thing. And just want to let you know that it'd be nice if you come up and say, hey, listen, we crack your dash. I'm sorry about that. I'd be like, okay, no worries, bud. It happens, man, eh? What do you do? So they gave me a free oil change, which is good with me. So we're gonna go get that done. Now I made that a really long story, it didn't have to be, but you know what I'm saying. So don't forget to subscribe and like and hit that notification. If you like going to uh, Park Lane, shove olds for a free oil change, cause I do. I got two oil changes sitting at home, but I might as well go for my freebie, why wouldn't I? So we'll go get this done and then we'll do something else together. What do you think of that? Leave a comment down below if you think that's a good idea. There's Jamie over there at J&J getting ready to go for lunch by the looks of him, eh? Friggin' right. And there's a guy swinging the old sign around for some uh, very expensive subs. Why wouldn't it be? But here we go, we're almost at Park Lane. Hopefully they're not too busy, like I said. I called and they said they weren't busy, but we're gonna find out in a minute here. We got one car lined up behind, so we're not too bad, I don't think. Not too bad, uh-oh. Where's he going? Better not be cocking me over. Nope, he's not. That's Buddy. Buddy, old pal, old buddy. What are you doing? Chachi. Chachi Mastati. All right, there we go. We're here. We'll put our mask on, go inside, and do what we got to do. Well, that wasn't too bad. In there for about 45 minutes. They had uh, two in front of me, so, I, you know, 45 minutes, still pretty good timing. <clears throat> they did good, they did. But they told me that my stable track and anti-lock lights are on on the dash, so that's something new, right? Do you believe me? It's like, uh, they told me, I was like, well, isn't that normal? The way they're supposed to be? It's way past lunchtime. I haven't ate yet. I've decided to run up to the bridge really quick and get myself a plate of fries. I don't know if any of you know. Look it up. Look up Sarnia, Ontario, French fry trucks. We have some good French fry trucks in Sarnia, and they're pretty decent. So that's where I'm going to go, get myself some fries, and head home. Maybe. I should actually get a salad. Frank. The streets in Sarnia suck, Bradley. What's really going on, Captain? Burp. Freaking Captain hats. Captain and engineer hats everywhere. What's really going on? Get out of your way, Jim. How you doing, Mr. GoPro? Good, you? Pretty good. I'm not recording much, but just sitting here waiting until you need me. Aw, dick. Get out. Get out! What in the F was that? How you doing? Cut the lawn. Decent. It is way too windy to fly the drone today. Look at that tree. It's not really too windy, but it's too windy. Ooh, I smell good. Hey, eh? I bought some new fabrics or shampoo or where the f I should, oh, what is it called? Um, dish or clothes soap washing machine detergent. There it is. I bought some new washing machine detergent and it smells really friggin' good. I keep smelling myself and I go, ooh, you smell good. Hey. Eh? Buddy's just talking over Buddy and in his e-bike, middle of the goddamn road. Get off the road! What's really going on? Careful! Like I said, the streets are dick. Uh-oh. Some construction going on here. Uh, careful. Don't cock her over, Jim. Get her done right. Uh, careful. Ooh, somebody's getting some masonry done. I wonder if he's doing the chimney. I should call him because I need a chimney redo. Oh, he's doing the front porch. I should give my dingo. Say, hey, bud, listen, Linda, come look at my chimney. I should do my own damn chimney. It can't be that friggin' hard. Break it off, get, mix up some cement, get a couple bricks, <laughs> slap them in, and done. I think I will do my own chimney. Leave your comments below if you think I should do my own chimney. I only gotta get a top plate and maybe three rows of bricks, and she'll be golden. Tap with a hammer, take her out, and away you go. Look at McDonald's. Just lined right up. What's really going on? How is everybody, oh. This guy's just cocking me over. Frick, now the light's cocking me over. Let's turn. Let's go down this way. We'll go down this ramp right here, down near the water, and we'll go along that way. Because that's what I do. Carol, Easy. Gentle. Yeah, you know it's windy when there's white caps. Oh, they're dredging over there, Jim. Frick, I wish it wasn't windy out. I'd get a dredging video for you. Hey, that'd be decent. I wonder if this place has debit. Oh my God, Boutine, it says. Captain. 
but he's got his motocross helmet on riding his bike. He's all set to go. Look at that thing. It's an off-road bike, eh? He's gonna do some serious jumping, that guy. He's gonna do some serious something. Oh, I don't know if I told y'all, just so y'all know, May 10th, I go back to work. May 10th, we go back and join the rest of the world instead of living the do nothing dream, which is not good because I'm always doing something. I'm doing nothing at the same time, so I need my exercise. The jog keeps me in better shape. If I did this every day, I'd be in trouble. Those are neat little cranes, the little Protestants they are. Let me know in the comments below if you drive a Protestant or ever have. Where's Buddy going? Oh, dick. He's one of the plight ones. And they're not putting boats in the water right now because it was locked down, so that sucks. So I can't get you any boat launching videos. If I could fly to America, I'd get you some. But no go on that O, Capto. Anyways, I normally go to Albert's Fries because normally Albert's is my favorite, but I'm gonna try somewhere different today and I'll let you know what I think. How about that? That sound good? Looks like I'm not gonna let you know dick because neither one of them are here. What's really going on? Well, guess what? We're not getting fries where you thought we were getting fries because they're not even up here. There's just the one over there and I don't want to go to that one. I have my reasons. Cocked over. Look at the garbage pails blowing all over the place. Pick them up. You're sitting right there eating lunch. You better pick them up when you're, oh, it's the yard. Forget it. Sorry about that. It's not their job. Is Albert's open? Oh, dick. Let's have a look. See? Yes, they are. Albert's is his, Jim. Well, I got Albert's again. It's good as always, but I'm a little disappointed because the fries aren't quite done enough for me which is the same as last time. Leave them in there a little longer, you know, a little. Let's say just did an oil change, but it, uh, I like crispies, eh? But it's still good. Mm, not as good as I remember. Yeah, I like my fries done a little more than that. Damn it. Coleslaw is still awesome though. Well, there we go. Fish was delicious. Like I said, fries could have been cooked some more. Other than that, she's mint. Look at Buddy's windows over there. Tell he smokes and never cleans his windows. Holy. Ew. But we're gonna get rolling here and see what the day brings. Is that, I wonder. What is that, I wonder. What is this, I wonder. How come he hasn't welded these things yet? Well, heading out, getting home, finished visiting. That was race car, if you're wondering, put zoomies on already. Right? So that's pretty freaking decent. So you'll see that car this summer at the racetrack. So stay tuned for that, if he gets it out this year. Still waiting for parts, so you never know, Captain. But we're gonna run home now. Well, home sweet home. Tell you, she's still windy out. He hasn't let up any. But I was thinking about maybe going out for a rip on the old Dees. The old Dees. Can you see her? There she'd be. The question is, should I or shouldn't I? Yeah, I should. I went out a decent here and I ended up in a spot where I ain't going any further because I don't want to get decent muddy. Uh, so let's back her up into this spot right here. And we'll turn her around, Jim. Without getting her stock, Captain. <sighs> Aw, oh, dick. Dick, dick. Aw, oh, dick. So here, come for the ride and have a gander. Then you let me know what you think back in here. Show you where I go. Can you see? There we go. Let's rock. And Bob's your uncle. Enjoy the music while cruising because the wind's going to get nasty up here. Because that's what I do. Give you a little angle and dangle so you can see me. There you go. Careful! Work you. Yeah, I did. Nothing like a good whack. 
down. and it goes way down there. Captain? So let's go this way, and there's a wind picking up, and we'll see, I'll show you where this goes. Well, you know where it goes, it goes to my house. Loosen dicks.
Well, let me tell you, that wind is still friggin' cold. Holy. But anyways, hopefully you enjoyed that little drive around on the golf cart and my little drive into town today and, the, oh, and this and that and the other thing. Hopefully everybody's having a good day like I am. Love you all. Thanks for being here. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. And until next time, you know what to do for now.